We start with breaking news tonight. At least four people are dead after a mass shooting at a video game tournament in Jacksonville, Florida. At least 11 other people have been wounded. Tonight, police say the suspected gunman is dead. I'm Ken McLeod. And I'm Katie Brace. Part of the shooting was actually streamed live as players took part in the tournament. WBZ's Tiffany Chan is live in the Satellite Center with the details. Tiffany. Katie, Ken, those players were focused on the screen when gunshots erupted this afternoon. In those recordings, you can hear the terror in their voices as people frantically ran for cover. A video game tournament turned violent Sunday after gunshots rang out inside of a bar in Jacksonville, Florida. Authorities say multiple people are dead, including the shooter. We have no outstanding suspects at this time, no outstanding suspects. Uh, we have one suspect in this case. He is deceased uh, at the scene at this point. The tournament was streaming live online when the gunman fired 13 shots. Excuse me, not an easy out. You can hear the players whose eyes were focused on the game, screaming for help and taking cover. <laughs> One witness says he heard the gunshots and took the shirt off of his back to tend to victims. First thing I did was I flipped them over. Next thing I did was apply a pulse, see if we had a pulse, you have a pulse. Next thing I did, take off my shirt, apply pressure to the wound. The, the bullet wounds this deep. The Jacksonville Sheriff's Department says dozens of people were inside of the game bar competing in a Madden Xbox event at the time of the shooting. Chaos erupted as employees and bystanders desperately searched for a safe place to hide. One gamer who was at the tournament the day before says it was a friendly game that unfortunately ended in tragedy. I don't know if I'm uneasy about it. I'm way more upset that someone got this upset over a game than anything. A simple game, it's nothing crazy. You play it every day at home or wherever you play it at. It's, unfor it's really unfortunate. Authorities have yet to release the suspected gunman's name. This is still an active investigation into a possible motive. Tiffany Chan for WBZ News. Again, we're learning that at least four people are dead in a shooting during a video game tournament in Florida. Please tell us the suspected gunman is also dead. We'll stay on top of this story and bring you the very latest developments on WBZ News at 11 and online at cbsboston.com.